your girl Coco Styles and on this channel we talk about beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. But today I'm going to do a vlog. I've never done a vlog but I thought this would be a good vlog during the whole lockdown. So we are going to Callaway Gardens in Georgia. It's about two hours from Atlanta and it's open and you know it's something to do. So I'm going to try to record as much as I can on the inside um, so you guys can see. And if you're out here, take a trip. Alright guys, so I'll see you guys in a second once I get there. Hey guys, so here we are inside of the butterfly, I guess you can say butterfly house. Um, it was absolutely gorgeous inside of here and something that I wasn't really expecting. I Honestly, I don't know what I was expecting walking in here, but there were butterflies flying literally everywhere. I kind of felt like a kid at times. Um, that's why I'm doing a voiceover because it was a lot of, oh my God, this is so nice. Oh, this is so pretty. Um, and I just thought that I would just cut that down so you guys don't have to hear me getting all mushy over the flowers. But, um, I think this is a really good place to go for just a day trip. They do have log cabins out here, um, that you might want to stay at in the area. The ride was about two hours from Atlanta. Wasn't a bad ride. It wasn't expensive. I did see some restaurants near but um, as you guys know, I am a vegan, so I just kind of brought my own stuff, and that was pretty much it on the way there. But here I'm just showing you guys inside. This little area right here was, I don't know, it looked like it was kind of like out of order. I think it, it might should, oh, I'm sorry. It could have been like a waterfall or something, but it wasn't functioning um, the day I was there. But other than that, everything else was really pretty. Um, the flowers were gorgeous. I do feel like they keep it up really well. Everything was labeled on what type of plant it was. Oh, I'm sorry, what type of butterfly. Butterflies was in that area. And, um, they had beautiful plants. Just different types of plants. They had benches and stuff. So if you do have children, I did see a lot of children there. It, it's a nice place for kids. Um... They also have like picnic areas here. So if you wanted to have a picnic with your family and then go to see like all the different things that they have, then I would definitely recommend this place. Like I said, it's only two hours, so a quick trip with you and the kids and have a good time. So this was something new for me because I'm not really a nature girl, <laughs> but I did really enjoy it and seeing all the butterflies and stuff. So there's one actually sitting on the banana peel. Um really pretty and it was just nice it was a nice little quick trip I did go by myself I just wanted to just get out of the house for a little while um look at those beautiful like I guess it's like palm trees very pretty um there were a lot of kids uh there were a lot of families there so and maybe if a handful of people who were like by themselves but it's it's a nice place like this is something that I would like to be close to living wise um because I would probably spend a lot of time in here just kind of kicking back and having a good time but it was super hot in here guys um the reason why I put I'm such a baby because <laughs> a couple of butterflies was like near me 
but it was so hot on the inside. They did have like fans running, which kind of made it kind of loud. Um, so uh, keep that in mind when you're going. If you are recording something, it does pick up all of the sound in there. But other than that, it was just a really nice place that, you know, something that I think that, you know, everybody should kind of go visit if you are in the area or if you're probably like a few hours away from Atlanta. Um, but this is in Pine Mountain, Georgia. So, but it was a great little trip for the day. And this is my first vlog that I wanted to show you guys. And I'm just gonna, I said, don't wear a jacket because I was hot. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, this is my first vlog. Just trying it out. I'm going to load it just in case, you know, someone is looking to go here. Um, I don't have much footage, but I got enough to show you guys. But again, it was a really, really nice place. There's other things in this park also um, that I recommend you guys going to. I didn't get to go because I just, I spent so much time inside of here and it's just started getting extremely hot. So... Go early, have a good time, bring a picnic blanket, take some food, bring the kids, bring your husband, bring your whoever, and have a good time. So, and that was pretty much it, guys. Also, they did have, in some of the areas, I may show you guys, I think it's towards the end, um, they had some land turtles inside of the water. That was pretty cool. Um, I thought that was actually pretty cool. Not huge, but they were big enough. Um, the kids there, they, they actually really loved it. And some of these flowers and plants and stuff, it looks like my mom had them in our old place, but it was just really pretty. A, just like a, a beautiful, like greenhouse that had butterflies in it. So, but that's it guys. Um, I'm just going to actually let some music play out so you guys can see the rest of this. And then I'll probably come back talking while I'm kind of walking in the area. But you know what? Also, let me not forget. It's actually super clean inside of here and in the park, um, which I was actually really surprised at, that they keep it up really, really well. And I thought that was something, you know, that I could mention because sometimes some parks are kind of messy. They're not really clean, but I can tell that they put a lot of effort into keeping it up in there. Um, the grass was cut really well, just flowers and stuff everywhere that just made the, the place look really nice. So, um, and then, you know, it can be like a little trip for the kids. They have signs everywhere kind of telling you things about the butterflies and stuff. Um, inside wasn't that big. It didn't have much going on inside walking into the building. They did have like some butterflies and like some cases, but not much. Um, the action is all inside of this room. So, yeah, so I'm getting ready to pretty much walk out, looking at some stuff um, as I'm walking out, and that's it, guys. So, like I said, I'm going to let some music play out for you guys and just end this video and come back towards the end uh, with, some, with me talking as I'm walking out. Oh, actually, here's the turtles. Maybe I'm not leaving just yet. The turtles are right there. Do you see them? Yeah, they were pretty nice. Yeah. It was it was actually a really nice place to visit. And like I said, I wasn't really expecting... I don't know what I was expecting. Um, I definitely wasn't expecting butterflies to fly everywhere in there. But um, it was it was nice. I didn't want to get the little girl on camera. It was nice. And that's it. I'm just on my way out. It's not super huge. Oh, did you see the butterflies? It's not super huge, but... The flowers and the plants, it just makes it look so amazing along with the windows and the lighting and stuff. So, but that's it guys. So I'm just walking now back to my car and I will stop the video so you guys can hear the craziness that I'm saying. All right. So I'm kind of walking back to my car um, and I totally could have driven up here because there's parking back there um so if you do decide to come do not park down the hill <laughs> and if it's warm outside dress appropriate don't be like me because i have on a dag on jacket uh, but it's pretty
pretty inside, really. I'm not even a, like a insect person. Um, but it's pretty. It's good for the kids. Oh, it's a duck! I see it. I see it now. It's like, I see the head now. Yeah, let's see what else. They have some swings here. And people are staring, but I really don't care, which is so crazy. Um, but it's nice. It's pretty on the inside. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty. I'm gonna see the other uh, location. I think it's called Discovery something. They have like a bunch of different gardens here. I think this is really good for kids. You know. Um, especially little little ones. They'll probably like the butterflies and stuff like that. They have some turtles on the inside. Land turtles. I think that's what they're called. Oh, hello. Yeah, this is nice. And then they have some little flowers here. Uh-oh. This is pretty. I just think how much it takes to like maintain something like this in all these areas. But I did I did see some people um keeping it rather clean. On the other side, let me flip the camera. <sighs> you see how greasy I am, guys? So I did see some cleaning crew on the way here, and I totally got lost. I missed my exit. I mean, it wasn't a bad ride, but I totally missed it. it set me back like 20 minutes, but it took me in a circle. Um, but I did see cleaning crew, keeping it pretty clean. Um, I think this is really nice a good picture spot if you are a person who likes to take photos and I think I am going to take some photos here right now I think I am and I don't care who's looking <laughs> but this is my first vlog guys a trip to a day trip to Callaway Gardens in Georgia and this is the butterfly center um yeah i don't know i may put up my tripod here and take some photos what do you guys think you think i should and let's see that is going here garden it's just it's really nice i guess no home depot for me buying regular uh, flowers and stuff. Um, yeah, I'm gonna drive to the other place and see what I can get. I wanna take pictures, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna do it. Maybe I will. I'll see. I can drive back.